Welcome to our Bible True Stories. My name is Teacher Des, and I will be your Bible storyteller for today. And the story, it is about Esau and Jacob, the troubled with twins. This is in Genesis 25 to 27. Isaac loved the Lord and grew to be a great man of God. At age 40, he married a woman named Rebecca. Like Abraham and Sarah, they prayed that God would bless them with a child. When Isaac was 60 years old, the Lord answered prayer with a double blessings. Rebecca was going to have a twins. Even before the babies were born, Rebecca felt them kicking and fighting each other. Why is this happening? she asked to the Lord. The Lord answered and said, Two nations are inside of you, and the two will be separated. One will be stronger than the other, and the older brother will serve the younger. On the day of their birth, Esau, the firstborn, was red and hairy. Jacob was fair and smooth and followed with his hand, grasping Esau's heel. Just as Rebecca had been told, the two boys were very different. Esau grew up to be a very skillful hunter, while Jacob liked to stay close to home. One day, Esau came home weary and tired from a long day's hunt. Jacob had just finished cooking some tasty stew. Esau was very hungry when he said, Jacob, let me have some of your stew. Jacob replied, First, sell me your birthright. This meant that Jacob, the second born, would have all the special honors given to the first born. Esau swore before the Lord and gave Jacob his birthright. How foolish he was to sell his birthright for so little. Many years had passed and their father Isaac became very old and blind. Fearing he may die soon, he called for Esau and said, Take your bow and arrow to the country and bring back some wild game. Prepare a meal just the way I like it and bring it to me. Then I will give you my blessings. When Rebekah heard what Isaac said to Esau, she called for Jacob. She told Jacob she had a plan to trick Isaac so that he would be the one to take the food to Isaac and receive the blessings. Jacob was concerned Isaac would know. Jacob said, The Lord had given me a successful hunt. Rise and eat and give me your blessings. Isaac said, Come close so I may touch you to know if you are really Esau. When Isaac touched the hairy goat's skin hands and smelled Esau's clothes, he blessed him, saying, May all people bless and serve you. My nations bow down to you. Now Jacob had taken Esau's birthright. And blessings. When Esau heard his father's word, he cried, Bless me too, father, bless me too. Isaac raised his hand and said, Your brother has deceived me. He has taken your blessings 
and I have made him Lord over you and all his relatives. I can give you nothing. Esau hated Jacob and said to all, The day is coming when I will kill Jacob. Today's affirmation, I will be a blessing to others. Say it with me, kids. I will be a blessings to others.